Okay, good afternoon. Back again. Today, I'm going to be back shaving with the Williams in a Surrey brush that was my granddad's. It's got some definite wear on it, but still works pretty good. And the new Ever Ready Lather Catcher I got in the other day. Uh, we decided this was one of the later models. They made them until 1914, and this is towards the end of production, probably. Uh, before they started making the what we call the 1914 which I don't uh, I don't have one right here but anyway so uh, that's an ever ready and it's gonna be more fun than a bucket full of rubber toad frogs I'm telling you so all right well here we go see if we can get the Williams to cooperate today it usually does for me I know some people have problems with it but I'm a member of the fan club of the Williams with this Surrey. Got about a uh, day's growth there, a little over a day's growth, so that ought to be good for the first shave on the Ever Ready. <clears throat> I've got a, uh, a 1910 and a 1911 Jim uh, leather catchers, and the 1911 is very similar to this one, so it should be a, uh, a similar shave and shouldn't give us too much problems. Uh, Getting the old whiskers whacked off here. Ah. Work there. Oop, gotta show it this way. Where the Williams is starting to do its thing. Still kind of airy down in there. We'll fix that with a little, little work. So, we'll straighten that all out. All right. This is, uh, like I said, a Surrey brush. And that was, uh, I think, what I read. I don't know for sure. I think uh, Vanderhagen, VDH, bought them out sometime in the past because the brush handles look, uh, my VDH? The brush handles basically look the same. So I figure somewhere along the line that's what happened. And I don't know how long my granddad had it. But it's uh, definitely seen some use. Yeah, we was doing pretty good today. I think it's gonna be all right. Take a little time to get a good lather built. It's my first use of this razor, but it. We'll get it. All right. So this has a relatively short handle, which is what a lot of the single edge razors have. And uh, I haven't found pretty nice shape. I haven't found that there is a uh, lot of difference to me between a, uh, actually this is a really nice shave. Between the, the long handle and the short handle, uh, I haven't, well can you hear that? Definitely got some audio coming here. Good job. Ah, yeah. Look at there. Every once in a while. I didn't take enough time building my ladder. Got a little clear on the side of there, so we'll just put a little bit more on. That'll give something for the folks who aren't fan of Williams to laugh at. Yes, indeed. Nothing in the world wrong with that shave right there. All right. First pass. Get that cleaned up a little bit. 
Let's see, they did a pretty fair job. And a few more swirls here. the catcher. It's pretty much against the grain going right under that chin there. And it's still doing a really good job. shades with the uh, pretty much the same angle as what the gym does you have a similar model which I don't think is real surprising it off real quick and no weepers today I didn't, didn't do anything to cause a weeper be right back hazel going here I do uh, all my clean up touch up passes whatever you want to call them, with uh, witch hazel I put it on I can feel the areas that are going to need a little little extra attention the sides are skin then always need a little extra work and a little bit of buffing under here, a little quick sliding backwards and forwards there. You can clean up. You got a nair that needs a little more. Oh yeah. So 19, eh, 12 to 14. It, I, I don't know how to exactly date it, but it's definitely one of the later models. I, I bought it thinking maybe it was a newer one, but it wasn't. It's still a very nice razor. The, the lather catchers are, they shave great. I, I highly recommend one. Uh, in fact, I keep a uh, 1910 Jim Jr. bar. It's uh, got the little bar on top of this one that I don't have on the other one, but uh, I keep that one. It's probably my favorite razor. Use it fairly often. Well, there we go. All cleaned up. I'm going to splash on a little Stetson and we'll be good. Y'all have a good day too.